How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here and we are back playing Stray. This is episode 4. Let's jump into the sewers. I feel like we are probably over halfway done with this game, so... Not sure how much further we have to go, but... If you missed uh, the last episode, we got the Disruptor and we lost the Disruptor in the same episode. And now my drone is kind of... Kind of not feeling the same anymore. There he goes. I thought we revived him last time, but I guess we got to revive him again. Maybe it didn't save. Yeah, we already, we already, he said the same thing there. Okay. Now. All right. Let's hack the ventilation system so that we can get out of here. Hopefully that fan doesn't turn back on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Moving along, guys. This is a fun series. I'm excited to see where it goes. It's a little bit creepy in some parts. But, uh, yeah, it's an interesting story, and I want to really get back to my cat friends, you know? Back home where it's beautiful sunshine and rain. Oh. It's... Is that Momo? No, it's Seamus? Who is this? Oh, it's Baladin. Baladin, a, a new person. A traveler from the sewers. We haven't seen one of you in ages. Are you the one who contacted us earlier? Little outs The little outsider. Zabaltzar, the outsider, has been expecting you. He's meditating at the top of our village. Okay, so you have your own vi- Whoa. Bro, he actually made it to the outside, I think. We're so close now. Ant village. Oh, cutscene. Whoa, cool lights. I like your bridge. It's a little bit shaky looking, but it works, I guess. Hey, drone, don't get too far away from me, man. Last time you did that, you almost died. This machine, the scientist I assisted used one of these. He was sick. This was his last hope. He walked into the machine. Is that like a cryo sleep chamber, probably? But I wasn't with him. He was alone. What was he doing? He uploaded himself into the computer and then everything was different. But the upload, something went wrong. He was stuck for hundreds of years until a little cat appeared. That was you. You're the person. Was it? It was me. I was the scientist. I was human. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness. B12 was a human who uploaded himself into the network. Ah, I see the little outsider badge on me. That's actually the first time I noticed it. I I need a moment. Oh, we unlocked a core memory. Nice. I was wondering about that. All right, let's get it back up here. So now we know that uh, B12 is, in fact, the doctor who was trying to escape and probably got sick and had to go into the computer or else he was going to die. I'm sorry. I I need a moment. I don't feel like talking right now. Okay. Hey, guys. Bring me to your leader. We got a memory right here, it looks like. And I can't target it. Maybe I got to scratch first. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, get that get that scratch it scratching in. Alright, can I can I see the map? Dude, it won't let me Do I gotta sit here? I can't hit X right now. Like B12 won't remember this. Okay. Maybe we gotta go talk to Doc first. Or not Doc. You know who I'm talking about. The leader dude. I'm assuming it's up here. Whoa, guys. We're on a swing. What? Um, I don't want to sit there and just, like, waste time. So, I guess let's just keep going. I want that memory, though. I'm not going to forget that memory, am I? I hope I don't forget this memory right here. B12 still not cooperating. So, I guess let's go find Zabalt Zar up here. What else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends. What happened to everyone? Well, 
I hate to break it to you, bro, but if you've been sleeping or basically in a computer for a hundred years, they're probably all dead. I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to save? The robots, bro. We're, we're all actually, what if every single robot here used to be a human? Bro, that would just like kind of blow my mind. But at the same time, it makes total sense. If, uh, if this dude uploaded himself, probably other people did as well. Because we've seen those cryosleep chambers throughout the game. You know what I mean? I guess they're not cryosleep. They're devices to upload yourself. But you get what I'm saying. Wait, is this the same place? Did we literally... How do I get... Can I not... Can I jump anywhere from here? I don't think so. Dude, I'm at a dead end. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Here we go. Sneaky little pipe I almost didn't notice. Come on. There we go. Alright, we're getting close to the top now. Still can't talk to anybody, so... All right, here he is. We found him, Zabaltzar. Oh, wise leader. What is this? Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during his transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Momo when we received that call earlier. I'm glad to meet you at last, little outsider. You know Momo and Doc, so you're already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings me peace. Momo stayed in the slums. I heard you helped find Doc and Clementine. Yeah, Clementine is the last like major person we still have to find after Zabaltzar, I guess. She's in Midtown now. If you still want to see the outside, she's the one who can get you there. Apparently, she had some kind of plan to leave the city. Here, take this. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. Oh, is that? That's them. Okay. To reach Midtown, climb up our little village. It should be easy for a dexterous one like you. If you manage to reach the outside, you will be the very first. I'd wish you good luck, but you don't need it. I believe in you. I'm sorry for shutting down earlier. I'm human, probably the last in the world. Now look what's left of me. So much has come back to me. How much have I forgotten? Maybe if we find Clementine, we can restore my memories and get you back home at the same time. We can go back down and find out more from the companions or head onward to Midtown. We need to go back down. Uh, there was a memory. And unfortunately, it was quite a ways down. But we got some cool music to listen to now, right? Ah, oh, here it is. Here it is. Memory! This language, the companion robots made it up from scratch. How impressive. I remember it happening when I was in the network. I don't know when exactly, but at one time, all the communication started to switch to these symbols. I was stuck in a computer and alone for a long time. So I translated every symbol and word one by one until I was able to understand everything. Now that I'm out and I know their language, I am curious to hear all they have to say. Who's they? You mean the, the, the outsiders or the robots or the other people? All right, we can talk to a couple people, I guess, since we're here. Electric Zerk everywhere. Boy, what do you mean, Electric Zerk? Let's talk to a few more people just to see what they say, right? Oh, no, I ruined their game, but I got an achievement because of it. Worth. I can't, I can't even talk to them. Sorry about that, guys. I guess it was it was worth the achievement, though. Hey, talk to me. Talk to me. It keeps popping up for a second. There it is. <laughs> Did you know there are more than 9,000 shades of white paint? Or 900, my bad. Don't tell anyone, but I'm creating my own shade of paint. I'm calling it Garbage Brown. I'm sure it'll be a great color of paint, bro. I do love the smell of fresh paint. So they can smell? It reminds me of, oh wait. I can't smell anything, how sad. I do it! You can't smell. May is her de deconstructivist period. May is in her deconstructivist period, so she says. I'm sure she'll become a great artist. If only she could practice elsewhere. Yeah, I, I feel that. 
All right, well, uh, I guess on to Midtown. There's a couple people we didn't talk to, but that, that's okay. We can't, we're not gonna talk to everybody. The soothing sound of trash falling. Shimmering waterfalls, no dangers. It's a blissful place to work on in my poetry. Listen. V, mighty concrete, shielding me in its womb. Shall you also be my tomb? You think it's too solemn? Nah, bro, that's actually a really good poem. I, I'm actually gonna think about that for a long time. Um, yeah, all right, let's just go to Midtown now. I'm not trying to like 100% the game, but like, you know, I'm not avoiding everything at the same time. I'm just, yeah, do a little bit here, a little bit there, and keep keep moving, keep keep moving, keep moving. Here we go. Want to see the end of this game? Wait a minute, what's over there? What's over there? Can can I? Yeah, there, there's got to be a memory over here, right? Can I get over here? No. Nothing over here? All right. Uh, wait a minute. Wait, up this pipe. There it is. There it is. They even put yellow stripes on the pipe to make it more noticeable, I think. Oh, cool. Look at this person. She's watering plants. Wait. Oh, yeah. The plants still need water and air, but they have uh, evolved so they don't need sunlight anymore. Hello, buddy. How are you? It's Malo. Malo. Did you know that Aunt Clementine taught us how to grow special plants that can live without sunlight? I have a huge collection of them. Do you want to see? It's still missing some colors, though. I'm missing a yellow plant, a red one, and yes, a purple. If only someone small and agile could get them for me. Wow. All right. I'll work on that. Dang. So that means I have to come back here? Where do I find these plants? Hey. Hey. Cool red leg. Pfft, I'm bored. Uncle Clementine used to hold classes here. We learned a lot of cool stuff. October the 11th, eh? Anything over here? Sorry, guys. Didn't mean to knock over your books and stuff. All right, I'll keep an eye out for the uh, the red, purple, and green flower or something. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. I'm trying to jump across. Can I not... Can I not get across over there? I can. There it is. Well, here's your blue paint. Here's your green paint. And, um... Yeah, now you're not bored, right? That was that was exciting. You watched me throw paint on the ground? I'm gonna go talk to him and see if he thought that was exciting. You're going to see Aunt Clementine? Can you tell her that everyone misses her? Bro, I... I did that for you. I did that for you. Oh my gosh, is this like a fast way back down? I didn't... Didn't really want to do that, but now we're in a new place, so I guess... Guess we could check out the bar, right? Let's go behind the bar. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't see anything too special. Hey, uh, can I get a drink here, guys? This food is actually horrible, but it's the only thing around. <laughs> They're like cables. I'll have to unscrew my front casing if I keep eating this trash. He's complaining that he's gonna get fat from the food not being, like, healthy. That is funny. Um, yeah, I don't want to keep going back down. It's a pretty cool place, though. It's like a whole nother little city here to explore, and... I'm not finding any of these colored flowers that she wants, though, so I, I have no idea. I think that... Yeah, whatever. All right, let's keep going back up. Up, up, up. No, no, more, no more detours. I'm sure you guys are just as eager to see where this game goes as I am. Do, do, do. So we only have one more person to find, really. Clementine. I don't think there's anyone else that has been talked about yet other than these people, so. Thank goodness I can't, like, just walk off these pipes because that would be pretty easy. All right, one last look now that we're up here. Wow. All right, so it's still, uh, still a cage up there, so we still can't escape that way, I guess. But it's pretty cool looking. <laughs> He's so cool looking. 
I love him. All right, here we go. On to the next adventure, guys. I already forgot the name of that place. Feels bad. I know we're going to Midtown, but I forgot what that place was called. All right, here we go. A little bit eerie, but nothing we haven't uh, experienced before, right? We're, we're used to this by now. I don't see any of the Zerk, like, biological horror stuff around here, so. Would love to get that disruptor back. Wait. It's a train. It's a rail. A rail car. Or something. Look, it's a subway station. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation existed. You could ride to anywhere in the city. People used to take it to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning, after saying goodbye to my family at home. I remember I was doing this for them, but they're gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see the outside, but does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? I'm guessing they're all dead or they escaped. Anyway, we're near Midtown, so let's find this Clementine. We have a picture of her. We can show it to some of the companions around here. Maybe they'll point us in the right direction. Another core memory unlocked. Only one more core memory, like one of those big orange bars. And I'm assuming there's stuff to... Wow, this is a cool subway. I mean, I guess it's a typical <laughs> subway, but... It's cool seeing it in this game. Look at all the chairs. Beep, 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 beep. Um, wow, it even still has a map. Lower town, upper town, exit. And we are very close to the exit. Look at that, the control room. Ooh, we're close. Too bad we can't just ride the subway, huh? Anything in here that's... All right, the controls. Can't do anything with the controls, I guess. All right, just checking, just checking. Let's go up. Mm-hmm. And up, oh, down. Convenient. I hear a buzzing sound. Oh, it's a it's a house. Hey, what's up? Another memory there too. Le Doc. Alright, don't talk to me. There are so many books here. The Turing Test Legacy. Oh, the Turing Test, you guys. That's a, that's a great movie. There, well, actually, I don't remember what it's called. But there is a movie about the Turing machine. Uh, it's like one of the first computers invented. It was during World War One or World War Two. Anyways, yeah, it's pretty cool. The Ethics of Artificial Intelligence. Ooh, the Ethics of AI. That's interesting. I recognize some of these. Did I have a library? I remember nothing was quite like the smell of books and the turn of a page. There was a feeling, almost like comfort. A book was like spending time with someone. So, everybody keeps talking about the smell of everything and like, now nobody can smell. Maybe that's why like, they, they miss it so much. Alright, well, uh, see ya, Ladakh. Thank you for that memory. Oh, hey, buddy. Another drone! A bigger drone, a more scary looking drone. What was he running from? Hey, people. Oh, it's like a teenager. I already told you five times, Yash. You can't run around like that. It's dangerous. Hey, this is the first time I've seen this kind of robot. You look so fluffy. Oh, it's the girl displayed on this wanted screen, right? Wait, she's wanted? You should ask somebody else. I'm too busy with Yash here to know anything. Why is this robot want wanted? Clementine, troublemaker, outside, rebellious. Please report any sighting. Wow, they betrayed her. Don't worry about trash. Nico Corporation takes care of everything. Yeah, the Nico Corporation invented the Zerg on accident. Zerk. Look at that drone. Please state your identity, Peacemaker 22106. Cooperate or we will have to transport you to jail and reboot you. 
please leave me alone. I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine, I'm sure she's hiding in the residence. Well, if you know where she is, then doesn't everybody? What's over here? Usually rooms that have a bright light, I seem to think, are drawing our attention. You know what I mean? Anything like over here? Huh. All these boxes that I can climb on for nothing, huh? Strange, but okay. I guess there's nothing here. Alright, so where is the residence that this dude was talking about? Access to lower level is restricted due to organic life hazards. Please keep out of this area. So that's an elevator to the lower level where we came from. The slums, basically. Ooh. Midtown. We made it to Midtown, guys. This is supposed to be, like, even better than the slums, right? I guess it looks a little bit fancier. This merchant crook sold me a faulty battery the other day. Now he just pretends not to hear me every time I try to confront him. If it wasn't for the sentinels on patrol, he'd end up a spare parts. Wow. Wait, I can do something here. I can nuzzle. <laughs> I nuzzled him and it just made him more angry. Alright, alright. Let's get to higher ground so we can look around a little bit. Very high ground, apparently. Did I just find a secret? What's over here? Why am I like... See, I get confused when like they have all these areas you can climb to, but then none of them go anywhere. Or, I mean, sometimes they don't go anywhere. So it's like, hmm. You never know, like, what's going to be a secret and what's not. I, we can go that way through the dark alley, or we could talk to this guy. A bouncer? That was a club. Club's closed. Get lost. Oh, yeah? Who are you? Police? Everyone's looking for her. I didn't, I didn't let her in, if that's what you want to know. All right. Oh, look at the clothing shop. That is cool, man. It's the trendiest shop in Midtown, but the shopkeeper is pretty grumpy. What a nice looking picture. Is that an address on the back? Yeah, that's the first symbol. Yeah, that first symbol is a street. Then there's a floor and a door number. Should be pretty easy to find. Okay, street, floor, then door number. Let's actually examine this a little closer. Floor, street number, or er, room number. So, the third floor, fifth door, and it's that symbol. Which, it's going to be kind of hard to remember. Oh, that's it up there. Let's look around a little bit. Oh, hi. Um, Alright, so the street. I... S I don't see any symbols for streets. Residency. Okay, it's that way. Okay, so I need to go this way. So it's this street, right? They don't really have street signs. Um, okay, here's the sign. Here's the symbol. It's definitely this street and then third floor. So we need to go up to the third floor. Somehow. Up oh, stairs, that helps. Okay. First floor now. Second floor. And where's where's another set of stairs? Here we go. Third floor. And then it was the fifth door. No. 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 Um is this back down? Wait. Yeah, I got I got to stay on this floor, so four, one more door. Here it is. Here it is. And of course there's a hole. This is supposedly where Clement Clementine is or whatever her name is. 
Wasn't that hard to find, to be honest. Like, everybody's looking for her, like, most wanted, and it's like... <laughs> Don't attack me with that lamp. I'm a friendly. I thought you were a sent... Never mind, who are you? What do you want? Show her the picture. Wait, so the Zabaltzar finally decided to send someone? I guess you're my new recruit. You're not very big. How did you even manage the sewers? I guess you must be pretty resourceful. I've been looking for a way to get outside ever since I left Ant Village. That's the name of that place, the Ant Village. But the Sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help. Follow me. Everybody wants my help. I'm used to it. I'm just a helpful kitty. Ooh, look at the lava lamp. Whoa. All right, all right, all right. I've been working on a plan to use this old subway for a while now. I even have the keys to start it. I knew it! I knew we were going to take the subway up! All we need is an atomic battery. I know Deco Corporation has one secured inside their factory. I have a contact who can help us. Okay, so you want me to go into the heart of the biological horror. Okay, gotcha. I don't know his name, but he's the robot with the bomber jacket and a gold chain. Take this message to him. A sticky note, really? Someone small and swift like you should be uh, have no trouble sneaking inside the factory. That's what they always say. They just assume. One last thing. Don't hesitate to ask around for help. City's full of information. I've been doing that. Stay clear of the Sentinels. Yeah. That's how I found you. Um, there was... Ooh, cool, uh, cool PC setup, dude. Pretty clean. It's actually the cleanest setup I've seen. Respect. Um... Yeah, I'm just, just gonna do a little bit of cat stuff and explore a little bit. I saw... So, oh, wait. Is this a plant? Oh, no. I thought we we're gonna harvest a plant for that one lady. She needed three different plants. You remember that? Like, how are we supposed to find all these plant things? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's gonna pull a box out. And what is in the box? Oh, nothing. It just helps us get up here. No, 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 no. There we go. All right, we found the source of the music. Cool blue stone, dude. That is a really cool thing. So is this just like your sleeping quarters? Dude, I love beds that are like up high like this. So cool. Very chill, dude. Very. This is the chillest house that I have seen. Might actually have to just chill here for a moment. I'm literally purring. I'm not even moving the camera. It's doing it by itself. Wow. How, wait, how far is it going to zoom out? So cool, dude. All right, we, I, we 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 got stuff to go. Let's go. We 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 got stuff to do. Nice little cat nap in the uh, the coolest little hangout place that I've ever been to so far in this game. But uh, now it's time to to further our quest, right? I don't think there's anything else in this room for us to do. Wait, that's a new room. Okay, I'm I keep seeing all these like plants, and I'm just assuming. That there's going to be a plant I can pick up for the lady, but I just can't find any. Alright, whatever. Guess we're moving on, guys. Do we go back out the way we came in? Or... Alright. So, we need to find uh, somebody in a bomber jacket and a gold chain. No idea where that is, so... Gold chain, bomber jacket. Wait, cassette tape? Hey, those tapes are ours. Don't you know that that's stealing? I could give you one, but you'll have to do something for Jinma, Miko, and me. The Sentinels have installed three security cameras to watch over us. We don't like that at all. Can you get them off our backs? Hmm. You don't like the security cameras. Where are... Oh. 
All right. We're on a quest. Let's go up to the second floor and see if we can jump down somehow and like knock out the security camera. Maybe not from here. Here's one. Perfect. And then there's one on the other side. Got it, got it. Uh... No, 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 bro. I didn't want to jump down. Can I jump back up? Of course not. My goodness. Sometimes I'm looking up and pressing A and it just jumps down. Well, at least we know where that camera is. I don't see the third. Wait, gold chain, gold chain, anybody? Okay. Uh, nope, next, next section. I don't know why we need a cassette tape, but... All right, and where is the third camera? Is it on the third floor? Oh, it's way up there. Ah, so yeah, I think I do have to go on the third floor and then jump down on it. Not a problem, not a problem. Wait. Oh, I see it, it's right there. Actually, I don't have to go up here, I see. I don't have to go up here, I just have to go from this side. Boom. Alright. How about now, buddies? Now that we're uh, helping each other out mutually. Well done, I didn't think you could do it. Here, take your prize, you earned it. Sick. We actually got a cassette tape. Dude, his head is just speakers. Oh, you guys are chill, man. Thank you for the cassette tape. We're just helping each other out. All right, now let's look for somebody in a jacket with a gold chain. Let's ask around, shall we? Hey, you guys seen uh, anyone? I used, to, I used to own a bar. It was the coziest place around here. Until I took a screwdriver in the knee. Now it's... <laughs> oh! A Skyrim reference in Stray. Oh my goodness. Love to see it. Even if this guy bums me out, he's my only customer. Try not to scare him away, please. Uh, they don't want to help me out. All right, fine. All right, bicycle shop here or? Hey buddy, can you, can you help me out here? You've been in the city below? I had a friend there, Fifi. Haven't seen him in ages. Everybody just says ages, but they don't say exactly like how long. Like how long is an age? A year? Ten years? A hundred years? What's that? What's an age to a robot? What's that sound? Oh, well that's the dark alleyway. Alright. So we're at the beginning. Let's see if we can find... A bribe? I don't take bribes. My values work. What is that anyway? How about the cassette? Uh, okay. Alright. I don't want to get in anyways, bro. Your club is lame. Hey, 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 hey. Fine. Beat it. Hey, you. Will you help? I'm busy. What do you want? Where did you get this? Wait, do you have the gold chain? He does! We found the dude! Oh, you're with the outside... I mean, my contact? Let me brief you about the atomic battery. I didn't even notice his gold chain. The battery is powering the Neko Corp factory right there, but this whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. They check every person who enters and turn away anyone who is not a worker. Here's an idea. Go get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here to check for a good time to enter. So, I have to do everything while you just sit here and chill. Got it, got it, got it. Hey, um, I need a... I need, I'm trying to look for a new job. Can I get a jacket and a hat? I want to work with you guys, please. Sorry, little one. You can't play over here. The Neko Corp factory is no place for a little fuzzball like you. Access is restricted, but only for a little while. If you can wait a few years, we'll open right back up. Oh, what's that song? 
just showing him the ca showing everybody the cassette tape because it's the only thing I have in my inventory. <laughs> uh, now nah, we already know what that says. At Neko Corp, we work all day long to gather the waste and send it downstairs, where they recycle and repurpose it. Speaking of downstairs, it's been a while since we had any news from them. Yeah, they don't recycle it downstairs. They sleep on it, and they eat it, and they become one with the trash. Just, I was just down there, so yeah. Anyway. Hey, Padre. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We know. We know. I need to find a, a jacket. How do I get in there? So I need to get through this door. How do I get inside that room? There's gotta be a door into there. From the other side, maybe? Hmm. Hmm. I see a pathway up. Don't know where to go anymore. Hmm. Well, we'll just keep looking. I love that I can crawl under the cars and stuff. So for sure, this is like where the Neko Corporation is. I'm assuming I can get in somehow. Or the jacket and helmet is like in a box I gotta like just knock over or something. Wait, I can get up here. It's very touchy on the targeting, but I saw it. There it is. No, oh, stupid cat. I'm sorry, you're not stupid. I love you. Let's go. Face, there it is. Please be something, please be something. Are you kidding me? It's literally... Is there anywhere higher I can go? Why do they have these walkways here if I can't even, like, do anything with them? I don't see any way in there. Alright. Uh... Can you give me a tip at least? Go get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet so we can get in. Bro, how? How do I get them? Wait a few years? I can't wait a few years. What are you talking about, dude? Alright, I guess we gotta go ask around town, like, how I can get one. Do you like my outfit? It's important for security. I got it from the clothes shop and the hat shop, but I doubt they have one. Okay. There we go. I thought I talked to that dude already, but I, I must not have. Well, anyway, now we know where to go. What's this? I never saw this place. No, no, no. I'm, not, I'm sorry. I don't want to claw your couch. I just want to talk to you. I guess I can't. Anything in here, though? All right. We know where to go, so maybe I should just... Yeah, I'm gonna, you know what? I want to knock some stuff over. All right. On to the clothes shop, which I know is impossible to miss. Here it is. Oh, now it's open. I don't think it was open before. All right. So let's just grab the... Uh, let's grab the worker outfit. Oh, I see it. Here's one. Ha! I can't steal. I gotta talk to this guy and distract him somehow. No, 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 no. You're not gonna steal that. Alright, we gotta distract him. Let's go over here and, uh... We're gonna insert the cassette. It's gonna distract him so that... I knew we would need that cassette. All right, we got the jacket. Where's the helmet? Where's the helmet? I don't see the helmet though. I like the song.
That was funny. Where's the helmet, though? Do I still have the cassette? I don't. So I could only use it once. Well, we definitely used it, like, properly. We got the jacket, but... They said the jacket and the helmet was both here. But I'm not seeing a hard hat anywhere. What's up there? Where am I? Oh, wow. So you can get into the shop from here? No, you can only go out. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, okay, well, maybe if I go talk to the guy, give him the jacket, he'll tell me where the, uh, the helmet is, right? That's the plan. What's this? Oh, it's a clo- All right, well, where- Like, none of them are actually wearing a hard hat. All right, well, let's go talk to the dude again. Because I'm not sure where a helmet is. Ooh, wow. That's pretty cool looking. Do not proceed further. The access to the outside is fully restricted. The elevator has been disabled. The exterior is unsafe. Do not proceed further. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, go up away. Hey, guys. Ah, oh, new place. All right, all right. Looking for a hard hat? Any of you guys, uh... What's up, dudes? Any of you guys seen a hard hat? The guy in the back is absolutely well-lubed, if you know what I mean. Only a big crash on the head could wake him up. Nice jacket. You work at the factory? The guy in the back? Oh, he's drunk, he means. Well lubed. Do I literally have to drop something on his head? Alright. Hey, buddy. Wakey, wakey. Tell me where the hard hat is. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hey, he has a worker jacket, too. Maybe he will tell me where his helmet is. Or did he lose it? He's gonna bring me to it. Watch, 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 watch. He's gonna bring me there. Dude, I am getting so lucky finding where I have to go, like, randomly, just by exploring. Usually, like, I could, I could easily waste an hour just searching for any of this. But, we're lucky and we just happen to find it. Like, dude, I guarantee he's gonna go find me a helmet. Be better. You better find me that helmet. Come on. Come on. There it is. The helmet. I see it. They're mad. They're mad. Ah, he's going to bring me inside. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Amazing. Amazing. Thank you. I knew this guy was going to bring me in here. Wait, I got to wait till he sets me down. Dude is like, <laughs> just woke up from getting smashed at the bar and now he's working. I'll take that. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh my gosh, I'm such a thief. Amazing. Easy. Got the uh, jacket and the helmet, guys. Let's bring it back to... What's his name? Oh, sorry. Wrong dude. Wrong dude. Wrong dude. Wrong dude. You're not my partner. My partner is this way. Let's go in here, bro. Blazer. Yes, I did. I'll get dressed now. Mind turning around? Are you kidding me? You're a robot and I'm a cat, but okay. These are great. A little snug around the waistline, but it'll do. Okay, hop in this box. I'll sneak you across the checkpoint. Again.
Well, let's see if this plan works. He's still wearing his gold chains. It'd be kind of cool if, like, I became the robot, like, I could control it. He's inspecting the box, but not looking inside of it. Incredible. Thank you, buddy. Okay. Bye-bye. Oh, do I gotta get in here now? Ooh, they're security drones, guys. Bro, can I... Can I, like... Get some help over here, bro? You just gotta talk to your friend? Alright, so... I gotta wait till the drone goes by, and then... Okay. Kind of like sneak mission going on here. Drone come back? Guess not. All right, let's go. I ain't scared of no drones over here. Yep. You do not see me. That was close. Dummy drones. Cats are always smarter. Oh, hi, buddy. Hey, good thing you're here. You can help me. I lost the keys to my place in this dark and huge factory. The Sentinels refused to help me. They told me, if no place to go, go more work here. If by any chance you could help me, I'd be eternally grateful. Would you drop your keys down there? All right, I'll look for them, bro. But, like, I got so many quests I'm doing already. You know what I mean? Don't know what that did. Oh, okay. Jump back, jump back. Okay, I can't jump back that way. Um. These, these are easy stealth missions, man. Woo, that was close. What if I go the other way, though? Ah, uh, whatever. We're going this way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He almost saw me. Almost. Open. Go kind of fast through this area. I hope I'm not, like, missing. Ho! Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did not see that drone right there. Like, I don't know what's that way, what's this way. Oh, this is the same. It's just a shortcut? Are you kidding me? Please don't see me, please don't see me, please don't see me. Okay, he didn't see me. Wow, you are a blind drone. So it's just a shortcut. Okay. Hey, bro. What are you doing? All right. Ooh, lasers. I see the security camera. What if I touch the laser? Would I become fried? Oh, no. It's going through my face. <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay, we don't touch the lasers. Got it. Uh... Okay, then uh, where are we going here? Ooh, not down there. I gotta get across. How? 
Can I can I go inside one of the cages? Can I I want to I want to take a ride like on the cage. Here's one that's empty. Can I go in it? Not at all, huh? Bro, I am blind or what? This is a dead end. Oh, the barrel. I didn't even notice this. My bad. It seems so obvious once you figure out a way forward. I love how the music got different right there. It's like... <laughs> All right. Can I move this thing or what? On or off? What does this thing even do? Oh, it follows me. Whoa. Whoa, that was cool. What if you stand on this one? Bro, this is crazy. There's the fuel cell thing. Oh. Can you go? Hmm. I bet you I gotta go in here somehow. Come over here so I can climb on you. Yep. Yep. Oh, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. And then after we get this, uh, atomic cell. Then I guess we can um, escape somehow via the subway. Turn on. You come over here. There it is. Are you kidding me? All right, we're gonna use this. Don't smash me. Easy. Uh, 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 security alert, security alert. Intruder, intruder. We got it, quick, let's get out of here before the Sentinel show up. We gotta get this battery back to Clementine. Okay, sure. Ooh, perfect little escape hatch for a cat. Oh, that was easy. Wow. We're straight back into the city. <laughs> Wait, vending machine? Nope. Keep looking for those energy cans. I can't find them. All right. Wow. That was super easy. Uh, let's get back to our helper here. Oh, no. Actually, our helper is... He's gone. He's, he's working for Neko now the rest of his life. <laughs> oh, excuse me. All right. Let's bring it back to Clementine. She is in the residence district on the third floor in the fifth house. We remember all this stuff. Oh, no, not here. We already did this. That's a cool city, though. I like Midtown. It, it's it's cool. Yeah, in here. Sup, sup, sup. Just passing by. Don't mind me. Bro, did I just go in a circle? I swear I just went in a circle. Um, this is the street. Where's the dudes with the music and the 
Oh my gosh, I get so lost. Sometimes I think I know where I'm going and then I'm like completely not in the right area. Okay. It is not that way, not that way, not that way. Mm. Let's read another sign. The residency, it, it, it's saying that way. Does it mean in here? It's this way. It has to be. Oh, it's blocked off now. Do you think the criminal is eyeing my collection of vintage cards? Yeah, nice try. You're not blocking me off. Yeah, it's blocked off completely. Ooh. Did they find... Oh, boy. Did they find her? That's not good. This is totally different than last time. Sucka. This is way different than last time. Very cool. We need to find a way around. I think we just did. No! 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 Whoa! 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 I like how the mission doesn't fail. You just get shot at. Yeah, you're not gonna get me. You're not gonna get me. Bye bye. Too easy. Too slow. Wasn't my uh, most stealthiest uh, mission, but it'll do. Where are you at, dude? Are you upstairs? You up? You back up here or what? I bet you he's up here. Come on. You in your hangout? Wait. Where? It? Where'd he go? You in your plant room? No, he's gone. Or she? No, Zergzon. Clem? Hmm. No sign of Clementine. Oh, what's that? It looks like some kind of coded message. We're going to have to play detective, figure out what happened to her. Look. For B12 and the cat, the answer lies in my stuff. And then there's four symbols. Sign Clementine. Uh, okay, the moon rock. We saw the moon lamp. The plant. Okay. Very strange. All right. Um, okay, here's one of the things, right? My sensors could only detect harmless chemicals. They can't recreate the calming sensation I remember. Like me, companions can't smell, so I wonder why they do this. There's also a message hidden under the container. It says, I'm with blank, 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 blank. Okay. We know that there's a couple items up top here, so let's take a look. Let's inspect the moon rock. This gem is of medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Wow. Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something useful. Bingo, there's a message. It says blazer. Okay, so she's with doing something with Blazer. Which, Blazer's in the Neko place, so I don't know how Clementine got into that Neko fate place, because we had to have a jacket and all that stuff. All right, anything else? Anything else? Should be two more items to interact with. Probably one in the plant room, right? Yep. You found something? I don't see anything, are you sure? What, do we gotta knock those over? Whoa. Huh, what an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this the way the companions here see humans? Kinda funny. Look, something's been left here. It says, blink, 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 come to. All right, one more interaction, guys. One more interaction. We just gotta find it. How do I... All right, whatever. So... The only place we didn't... Oh, here we go. Found something? I don't see anything, are you sure? They just put a bunch of random spots that are fake. Um... Here it is, watering can. 
Na? Nothing, nothing. Oh, here it is. Here it is. I have no idea what this is, but its glow is kind of mesmerizing. Sorry, I was elsewhere. <laughs> I didn't even notice the message here. It reads, Blake, 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 nightclub. Ah, uh, so I do have to go to the nightclub. I'm with Blazer. Come to the nightclub. And, of course, we don't have access to the nightclub. So it's like every single thing. Oh, wow. Did, whoa. Did you guys see that? The Sentinel was almost in here. Every single thing in this game is like, all right, you need to go here, but before you can go in here, you have to do X, Y, Z. And then you go do X, Y, Z and you get in. And then it's like, now you need to do X, Y, Z to go in this. It just keeps going and going and going. All right. Well, guys, this is going to be a good spot to end the episode right here. Uh, we're already at an hour. I don't think there's a whole lot left in the game, so I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. And maybe, who knows, maybe next episode will be the final episode. We'll see you guys. If you enjoy the series, please go ahead and drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more Stray and Brahalla and other games. This is Lucian Sword. You know what, guys? I think I think I, I know a perfect place to end the episode at. This is Lucian Sword and Walter. Take it easy, friends.